Welcome Libras. So this is my second video. I just had like a real, really, really dope video for you guys. Look. <sighs> the space. <laughs> it let me record majority of the video. And then when I thought that I was done, it didn't even record the whole video. And I'm steady talking and reading it. <laughs> I'm like, oh my gosh, really? But yes, so we're going to start fresh. It's okay. We're just going to start fresh. Let's see what we got for you guys. This is going to be for Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Libras. Keep in mind, guys, these are general reads. They may or may not resonate. Okay, if it happens to resonate... Great, this was for you. Don't forget to hit the thumbs up button, guys, to keep the channel and YouTube's algorithm. Go ahead and comment. Let me know what's going on in the comment section, as well as share with your family and your friends, okay? So, we're on a journey, guys. I'm trying to get to, um, trying to hit my 20K mark. <laughs> I got a little bit to go, but I know it's attainable. If you guys are interested in booking a personal reading, guys, that information is going to be in the drop box below. Currently, for the month of December, for new uh, customers and clients, the readings are going to be $25, okay? Which is a great deal because my readings are $60 and up. So, right now is a great time to book a personal reading if you are interested. As well, guys... You can head over to the website, guys, once you finish watching this video, of course, and check out the things that we have on the website, guys. We have amulets, ritual oils, body oils, sage bundles, uh, protection pieces, um, all types of goodies over there, guys. Check out the website, guys. Check out the website. All of that information is in the drop box below. Okay. So, let's talk, Libras. <laughs> Let's see, what message is there for Libras? Thank you. Okay. <laughs> All right. So we got the King of Earth, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. Lots of Earth energy here. We got the Queen of Earth, the Two of Earth. Like, there's lots of Earth energy here. We have the Strength card, which is Leo's energy. Okay. These are the same two cards that came out. That was at the bottom of the deck in your first reading that I just was telling you guys about. And then we got that five of fire. There's competition. There's quarrels. There's arguing. There's bickering going on. Somebody is really showing their ass here. Really. We have the five of earth. Okay. So this is fears. Okay. And this is also like feeling rejected or left out in the cold. Um, just worries. Okay, issues. We got the Knight of Water. There could be a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio involved. Or there's communication or some type of invitation. Okay, and then we have the Knight of Fire, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries. But this is someone, if this is a person, then this is someone who's non-committal. This is someone who, who doesn't really want to settle down. They're there one minute, they, they're going the next. Um, but nonetheless, this is quick pace movement, okay? So somebody is feeling rejected or left out in the cold or felt taken advantage of. That's what I'm getting here. Like somebody feels played. Somebody feels taken advantage of. Somebody feels left out in the cold. Somebody feels like they were done wrong. 
Let's see what we got. Why is the five of pentacles here? The queen of swords. Somebody definitely got cut off. This this is you guys' energy. Labor Gemini Aquarius. But something ended for sure. Something ended here. Somebody's tired of somebody bringing up the past. About how somebody ain't crap, okay, or they have their own issues or whatever. We got the devil here, could be a Capricorn, but somebody feels betrayed um, because there's some in, there's some type of ending here, and somebody definitely got cut off, and somebody's also trying to show somebody tough love here as well too. Why is the Queen of Swords here? The Queen of Cups. See, the same people are revealing themselves that just revealed themselves in this last reading that I was just telling you guys about. It's the same energy. Queen of Cups. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Somebody here. Mm, there's a shallow victory here. There's some, uh, some jealousy, some insecurities here. Somebody is too dramatic. Um... Somebody here could be arguing and fighting over a man here. The King of Wands and the Ten of Pentacles. I'm getting like this kind of like bad boy type energy. He might have a little bit of money. He might look good or he or she. But somebody here is like, I'm getting like challenging somebody or is trying to make somebody jealous or and I'm just getting like you guys are waiting on the right moment for your chance. Like somebody's waiting on a chance to for something to see where something's going to go. Why is the Queen of Cups here? The Emperor. Okay. The truth is going to be revealed and it's going to be revealed in front of everybody. Or this is everybody knows the truth already. Okay, about whoever this emperor is. Could be an Aries. Ooh, that's some, there's some type of ending. There's some type of ending. I got the Hierophant and the King of Pentacles. Someone here could be married. Um, we got the King of Pentacles, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. Uh, somebody is, is... I'm getting like... I'm hearing like... Um, somebody's whole story the whole story isn't hasn't come out somebody needs to be careful of what they say <clears throat> somebody's story okay okay why is the ten of swords here the empress somebody for sure for sure got cut off we got the mother and father card here this could be a mother and father situation this could be a husband and wife this could be a baby mother baby father situation but somebody left like somebody left they they shot out of there they got in there and they did it quick like it was a swift like mm, i'm gone okay Whoo, yeah like you saw or you heard about this on the internet you saw this okay something here about the internet that you saw on the internet. We got the strength heat card here. Could be a Leo involved. Hmm. Somebody was playing mind games. And somebody could also try to force somebody into a relationship. We got the Seven of Wands and the Ten of Cups, or somebody tried to sabotage your relationship. Woo. Yeah. 
See something ended and it's time to move on. It's time to make that decision. Okay, to move on. Someone here could definitely be married or is living with someone or is already in some type of commitment. Why is the Knight of Water here? Two of Swords. Two of Swords and a Two of Pentacles. Somebody here is juggling, okay? You may be confused because you don't really have... It's something that you are unsure about, okay? There's somebody here juggling. Oh. Somebody, you're trying to find out who does this... Is this Who does this person love? Who does this person really love? Who do you really love? King of Cups, lovers. This is definitely... Somebody here possibly juggling, okay? Um, somebody here needs to make up their mind for sure. <laughs> for sure, for sure. Or somebody has made up their mind. Yep. The judgment. This is that final decision. And this is something about tell everybody. Tell everybody the big secret Okay, the moon card here. Somebody's keeping something a secret. You want to know. You want to know the big secret. Why is this person keeping the secret about how they feel? This is making you feel left out uh, or rejected. You got the strength card again and the justice card again. See, yeah, you're spying. Okay, you're somebody here is on the internet. You're, you're watching somebody here on the internet. You could be spying on a Leo. Okay, somebody feels rejected. King of Cups, King of Pentacles, yeah. Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn, or Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio could be involved, but somebody feels rejected or left out in the cold. And somebody's been waiting for a long time. Somebody is, just, yeah, that two of pentacles again, waiting on somebody to make up their mind. Okay, what they want to do. Do they want to be married? Do they want to be single? Do they want to move in with this person? Do they want this commitment? You're this person, you're waiting for somebody to make up their mind. Knight of Wands, Knight of Fire, sorry, Knight of Fire, Knight of Fire, yeah, somebody here is regretting, you know, being a player, like I said, somebody here is for sure, for sure married, but they're behaving single, okay, Ten of Pentacles and the Hierophant, definitely, somebody here is married, but they're playing around, they're playing games, King of Wands, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries, okay, and you, I feel like this is just causing too much. This is just too much. You feel like this person is doing too much. Like, make up your mind. You're waiting for this person to tell you, to give you details on what's what, what's going on. But somebody here is guarded, okay? They're, they're, they're being very, uh, they're hiding something here. They're hiding what how they really feel and what's really going on. Like, yeah, you, this person, you feel like this person thinks they slick, okay? This devil keeps revealing itself. And this person may, like, not want to talk about because it it's, it's a situation from the past, okay? It's like thinking about the past. Somebody here is, like, thinking about the past, waiting on this person to bring it up or talk about it. What's the five of cups here? Yeah, Queen of Wands, here she goes again. This Queen of Wands could be regretting. Somebody got played, and I feel like it's this Queen of Wands, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries. Maybe you thought that everything was going to be, you know, all good here. Ooh, Ace of Cups and the Five of Wands. Somebody's feelings got played with. Why is the Queen of Wands here? 
Page of Cups. Hmm. Somebody is hurting. Uh, somebody got hurt here. And played. Yep. Somebody got played in the end. Somebody here got played in the end. And this the strength card keeps coming up. Could be a Leo. But somebody doesn't want to talk about it. You tried to get this person to talk and ask what happened, but somebody doesn't want to talk about it. And here's the justice card again. You guys' energy. See, for you guys, if this is you in the situation or it's vice versa, um, somebody here is very much so like good regardless. We got the nine of pentacles and the six of wands. This is very successful, independent, good whether you have somebody there or not, okay? But it's like you're just waiting for the truth to come out. I don't see, yeah, see, you're hoping that was what what somebody is keeping hidden is going to come to the light, okay? Yeah, see, you know that somebody got cheated on or somebody got, or somebody got lied, somebody's lying, Okay, that there's a third party. This, this is very interesting. Y'all gotta let me know what's going on. I asked, let me pull three more cards. <laughs> Give me three more cards for Libra. Let's see, we got the Ten of Fire. The Ten of Fire is very... Too much <laughs> feeling stressed somebody here is stressed in the night of air the night of air this is somebody who's irrational somebody's too irrational maybe you feel like somebody here is too irrational okay and we got the page of water ace of water and we got lots of water energy here now. Okay, five of water and the ace of water. Yeah. Maybe you're, I feel like some of y'all are feeling bad. Like you've, you've been feeling regretful uh, about something. Okay, that this chapter has to close. And guess what? Some type of truth is, is being revealed. Somebody here is moving on. Somebody here is moving on. Yes, there's an ending here. And I feel like you feel kind of bad that the, that there's an ending here. Are you guys ending something? Or is someone ending something with you? Or is something that you're witnessing <clears throat> ending? Okay, why is the Ten of Fire in here? There's that King of Pentacles again. Uh, it's something here I'm seeing. I'm hearing like, stop saying that you're single. Uh, the King of Pentacles, Page of Pentacles, Nine of Pentacles. Okay, definitely Earth Energy. Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn, Nine of Swords. The Ten of Wands is someone who's tired of something, who's stressed out, who's, you know, wants to take a break because they're, they're carrying a heavy load. Yeah, like you're trying to get somebody to talk about something. Why is the nine of swords here? Five of swords. Somebody here is causing problems because they're saying that they're single when I feel like they aren't. Okay. Somebody here, and I'm going to put this out there. Somebody got hoes. <laughs> they got hoes in different area codes. Area Hoes, they got hoes <laughs> in different area codes. Area codes. I'm telling you, look at this seven of cups, 
Queen of Wands, Two of Pentacles, and these, these people giving them a lot of attention, okay? And I'm telling you, they're saying, <clears throat> this person is saying like they're a single man or a single woman. It's causing confusion, okay? It's causing confusion, or at least you're confused by it. They're confusing everyone else. Somebody here is confused, and I'm telling you, somebody is being too irrational. Why is the Knight of Air here? Three of Swords. Heartbreak, you got the best of me. Here's that Queen of Cups again. Third party, okay? Why is, somebody is running back to a water sign. Pisces, Cat, Scorpio. Okay, the Wheel of Fortune. Three of Cups. Didn't I tell you? Three of Swords and Three of Cups is somebody who is heartbreaker. You got the best of me. I just keep on coming back and say to me, oh, why did you have to run your game on me? I should have known right from the start. You go and break my heart. Woo! But somebody got cut off. Or somebody is, is trying to cut this off, a third party off. Somebody got, somebody been playing. Mm -hmm, didn't I say it? The world. I'm trying to tell you somebody's cutting off a third party. King of Swords. Cut it. Cut it. Cut it. Cut it. <laughs> we got the devil here in the tower. There could be a Capricorn cutting somebody off. And see now, like their guard is up. Their guard is up. They feel like they got to watch what they say. Okay, and somebody here is having regrets, okay? Why is the page of water here? The emperor. Aries is energy. Okay, somebody, you may feel like you need to give this person advice. But I don't, I don't for some reason, like I just don't feel like this is... You, uh, this is you guys is uh, um i feel like this may be something that's going on around you or something that you see that's going on on the internet or um, somebody's coming to you giving you gossip and tea and i feel like you're giving this person advice um like i feel like whoever this devil keeps revealing himself as well see definitely could be a capricorn this person could be like um older than you or because we got the you know the emperor here the magician and the strength card this strength card keeps revealing itself too somebody doesn't want to talk you can't get this person to talk so maybe you want this person to talk to an older someone who they can re relate to or something like that but i'm getting given advice six of pentacles and the nine of cups Maybe somebody's, then maybe this person is getting advice from the wrong people. Okay. Yeah, you're hoping that this person stops. Okay. We got the star card, which is Aquarius' energy, but you're hoping that this person stops. Okay. Because you see, you, you see where this is going. You see where this is headed. Like I, like I said, I don't feel there's that Queen of Cups again. Eight of Pentacles, Queen of Cups, Seven of Pentacles. You're, you're waiting to see how this Queen of Cups feels. Um, yeah, you know that this person is a liar. They lie a lot. Somebody here is a liar. Uh, why is the star card here? And then we're going to, yeah, see, you're hoping this person progresses. You may feel like this person needs to spend some a long time, you know, some time to think, some time to gather their feelings and their thoughts, do some soul searching, okay? Yeah, this person, you may feel like, you know, they may need to, <laughs> you may feel like they just need to, like, you know, come from a more compassionate side. Uh, I feel like you may feel like this person is careless and irrational, okay? Somebody here is separated, and maybe this is what's been going on. They've been separated, and they've just been doing the most while they've been separated, okay? But the thing of it is, is you want to know whether or not if this relationship is going to be worked on, if this partnership is going to be worked on. 
Um, you just want answers. I feel like you want answers. Um, you want answers. And for some, I just feel like this could be your situation. For some, it is your situation. But for some, I just feel like someone may be bringing you this information. Okay? That's what I'm getting. Like, someone's bringing that information to you. Okay, we got Ask Your Angels. We got Improving Health. So success. So if some of you are dealing with health issues, it looks like there's going to be some type of success, okay? Um, and then we got perfect timing. So everything is, is you know, for me, that's what I'm saying. Like, you guys' this energy, I don't feel like this is, I feel like this may be someone bringing this energy towards you. Now, for some, this could be your situation, but I feel like somebody's bringing this energy towards you. Yeah, see, so you're going to have success in the near future. Compromise, okay? Somebody here is going to... It's all about timing to find some type of compromise here. So yeah, something is saying not the right time. So something here is about perfect timing in order to find balance on the situation. And we got improving health. reconsider and remain positive okay remain positive remain positive for some of you if you're dealing with health issues remain positive okay stay positive there may be something that you may need to reconsider as well okay so y'all let me know what's going on in the comment section below and i'm gonna chat with you guys later guys if you would like to book a personal reading the information is below and don't forget to check out the website guys like comment share and subscribe until next time ciao